watch this movie. That's so far. No, I'm not even gonna stop it. I watched this movie. Um, I did another movie. You can say movies. Movies literally take long. Like TV shows take like two hours. Like TV shows take like two hours. Um, an hour TV show. I have to add like thirty minutes extra on to the hour to thirty to the hour to the hour. But a uh, mother. And I'm only even stunned. The movie. That I'm gonna do tomorrow is gonna make it seem like this here is just them taking a thousand things and stuffing them in one and trying to make it be what it be. But I swear to God, it said there are about four parts in this movie that I would have cut out. Um, why they do not speak English? Shout about our movie, my team not say, and hit that bobo. What? Y'all like to what you just say? Okay, remember that, remember that. Remember, remember that. Remember you would say to what you say, okay. <clears throat> Let me focus, let me focus, cause your girl Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm doing state property. Yes. I'm upset that the first thing I do with my people. No good. But moving on. Because it was either state property or to do a Medea. And I gotta prepare myself for the singing, not the acting. I know I'm a lot of the acting. I'm not really sure how to explain the singing to you guys. So, you know, it's like, do I be like, oh, he jumps out? They were talking about this topic and then he jumps out. Like, I don't, I don't know. Anyway. I'm gonna be quick because I should not, I should, all this talk that I'm doing. I already have a movie. I promise you that. Okay. Plus, I'm pretty sure in this motherfucking reading, I do enough fucking sad talking. I do. No, too many. Okay, we start off with B. He don't want us to know his real name. He starts off the video by showing us his proof. He doing a voiceover. It's like a picture, it's probably like my school boo boo boo. He live in a city where ain't no brother we love, but he's gonna get killed. He's dancing in a strip club. Mm, mm. Oh. So, the amount of just so much on this movie. Okay. A whole rap song, a movie about a strip club for someone just want to start off a music video. I swear to God, this first this part felt like a music video, but don't worry, I'm you gonna be like oh, just a music video or a couple music videos because it was like somebody was like, hey, we gonna make a movie around the city and in these couple of scenes we want to have females kissing females. Somebody said, it, not me. Um, so that's hey, movie hasn't started yet. They had to remind people they were making a movie. I felt like they had to remind the people, like, hey, we making a movie, not a music video. Because what was the purpose of that whole little showing the strippers, dancing? If you just gonna go to the table and the main people is gonna be sitting there like, Like, what's the deal, my man? What's the deal? Damien was like, I want, I just want to give you guys some boobs and booty shots real quick. So then I said this is going to be hard because I watched this movie. And because Dean's best friend, I love him. I love him. 
and I let I renamed him. I renamed him Blue. So I'm gonna tell you this right off the very fucking bat, like, like this man can never do no wrong. I mean, even if he did do wrong, I probably would have been like, and Blue did no wrong. So don't be coming for me like, oh my goodness, you, you, you didn't come at, you didn't come for Blue. No, I didn't. Mm -mm. Okay. So I start off with Blue and Beans sitting at the table in the strip club. Blue telling Beans they in the club and he got his head in the clouds with his ass and breasts all around him. Because Beans is clearly, it's literally looking up. Like it's ass and boobs and they're like, mm, 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 mm. and they're doing all this other flashy stuff with their bodies and it's just rough. And it was a lot, so I had to, I have to say something about them. They did good at their acting job. So, my bad, they were just being a bar. B say, look at us, sitting in a bar in the middle of the day doing nothing. Blue hit his squat. Okay, so I just got to point out that this movie was made when you could smoke sweats everywhere. Like, you didn't have to walk six feet from the, from the damn, in, from the door. You could just be at the door puffing on a sweat or be in the, be in the hospital smoking on sweats everywhere and anywhere, okay? B says he need that real paper. What? Money say he needs that real paper. Mm -hmm. He needs that real paper. So I'm like, so he got a job making a little money because he said he needs that real paper. So I'm like, oh, so you get, so you need that real paper, which means that you catching a little rain. It's a, it's not a lot of paper, but it's a little paper. Probably made no sense to y'all. Y'all like, what the fuck is he talking about? Moving on. Bean said he got to get his own crib because he can't have sex with his girlfriend. I mean, I'm not even going to stuff y'all. Like, I literally was like, Bean's, Bean's A. Okay, let's start off. Let me say this before I even get deep into the get deep into it. Bean's disrespectful as fuck. In real life, not just in real life, but... In all drug dealer movies I met, this man would have been killed. Like, I would say gay. Like, his own peoples would have killed him because they would have been like, my man, I don't know why you looking down on me like I'm your son. I'm not your son. Um, When he went, when Biz went to talk to the Mexicans, oh my God, the Mexicans would have been murdered him. Any other fucking movie, Mexicans would have been murdered him. He disrespectful as fuck. He up in there talking about some pappy. My mess. Oh my god. I would have been took him out. Pop pop. Headshot. Mmm. Beans and his disrespect was just like it was it took a toll on my mental. Oh. Y'all gonna feel me though. Y'all gonna feel me in a minute. Beans like he gotta get his own crib because he can't have sex with his girlfriend. He gotta wait till mama go to sleep or wait till the mother go to work. The girlfriend be having him in the closet and under the bed. Blue start laughing and then say, say it ain't funny. Then sits up and say, he ain't joking. Like, he had these moments where he go from being like, kind of aggressive to even like hardcore aggressive. And it's like, Bean, come on. Good acting skill, son. Amazing. Love it. We was here for it. We were here for it. Roller coaster ride, I was like, Buckling my seatbelt, unbuckling my seatbelt, hopping out the side. I just want to know bitches over here committing suicide. Just boom, smack the head everywhere. Don't worry though, because I'm going to understand in a couple of minutes why that shit was popping off like that. Then since I should say he's not joking, and Blue say, You ready to make some real change? B say, You think I'm, I'm talking because I got lips? And do not get me wrong, I love all these puns. I think I was able to add every fucking pun and being said. Well, Blue acting like y'all had this talk before when you ain't never did nothing. So, that's sad, because that's what, that's how it was feeling. It was feeling like, well, Big Blue was sad and be like, okay, Blue's real name is supposed to be Baby Boy in the movie. But we don't call him Blue. Don't know why you asked no question. So don't get mad because he want to know if he's serious with him. Being said for real, he needs that house so his girl and his mom can be jacked out and live in lovely 
check to the Phillips. Yep, what he said. So him and his mom and his no, he what he said was him and his his mom and his girl. So you know his the girlfriend has a daughter. They here together. So she is also his BN. So sometimes you hear me prefer to her as being BN because. He had a name. They, I think everybody in this has a name. Has a name. Mommy? Now, would I remember their name? That's when my bad memory set in. Um, I did not try to fight it. I should have, but I didn't. And here we are. Mm -hmm. Is it right to me? So, Blue say he's feeling, but who want to pay that kind of money? This literally what Blue says. Blue's like, who want to pay that type of money? And I'm like, for drugs? Where you getting the drugs from? You worry about people buying the drugs when you ain't even got drugs to sell? What about the money for the drugs? So, B say, we get that shit for ourselves. And I'm like, does that mean they about to rub drugs? About to rub drugs? That's what I want to know. Being then as blue, what's the key to America? And blue says the Almighty Dollar. Being says pretty soon we on we gonna do what the fuck we want. Being says you know what I'm saying, and do not. Being says they gonna take the city by storm. Blue says you got that planned out. Let's just come up with with the bar money. I don't know why. When he said bar money, I thought he meant bond money. So I got bond money in quotes. Don't worry, my brain is gonna get very dumber before this this whole thing is over with. B say don't worry about that, and all that's already taken care of. And I'm sitting here like, what do you mean? Don't worry about that. That's already taken care of. Mm, what she gonna do? B, why you being shady in the beginning of the damn movie? It's not even long. It's okay. I don't mind talking to myself and saving it on the internet. This is live. You don't got to come over here and talk shit. Thank you for pointing out that ain't nobody else. Anything else you would like to point out? Okay. Now, where was I? Because he just threw me off. Okay. Okay. Okay, B said don't worry. Okay, he said don't worry about that. It's all taken care of. And I'm just sitting up here like, what do you mean it's all taken care of? How is it all taken care of? B tells him everyone's competition, so you got to make it where where it ain't no competition. Then he ends it with they either get down or lay down. Now, don't worry. Get down or lay down. You know, I'm going to say that so much. I'm not just writing a whole damn song. Get down or lay down, these bodies on the floor. Get down or lay down, or I put you on the floor. Thug life. They're like, what? Yes. Blue says, I feel you, but we going to need some soldiers to pull this off. Is that, did I say this type of thing? Am I like, oh my God, homeboy ain't got no. Oh my God. Hold on, y'all. My internet want to act recorded. Like, I do what I do, my nigga. I do what I do. And um, that might be a problem, isn't it? I'm gonna need you not to do what you do. Okay, so I need to come out. Go back. I'm gonna say. Oh my god! I just keep it in me right now. Am I going to get off live? No. No, 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 no. Please don't do this. Okay, is... Okay, whatever. I'm going to say that it's right here. Whatever. I hope this is it. Why do I walk up to some guy and say, what's up, dude? Like, he don't know him. He say... Talk that shit she was talking earlier, dude. Man stand up and say, you got something on your mind? 
been handled with vehicles. And I was like, oh my God, what's going on right now? I'm thinking you about to die, but be tough those final moments. Like, do I, you know, you know it, man. And random dude, what's up, bitch? And I'm, oh, snap, what are you going to do? And then all of a sudden, not, now mine, okay, that's what I, I'm missing. That's the page I'm missing. I'm missing the page where I talk about how the camera, like, cuts to, to white blue red coming in and he literally stands in the motherfucking doorway. He got this big old long shirt on. It's big. And you can't really see his pants. But he literally puts his pants. Like, he puts his hand. He puts his hand in, like, the pants. And he pulls his pants up. So you clearly can see that there is no gun on my man, right? So then he walks up to some dude that get into a, a confrontation. And then all of a sudden, White Durag got a gun. And he shoot dude. But when he shoot dude that first time, oh my God. Oh my God. I know a part of me should have panicked and be like, oh my God, he just shot somebody. That is so sad. But the sound effect was like, pow, pow. That's literally the sound effect when he shot him. Like, I laughed. He shot off two shots. Random guy didn't fall to after the second shot. He was running the stream in a white do rag gave white do rag white white do rag two buddy like four more times. Pop, 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 pop. And he gives the dead body a speech like, what's up? So now mind you, I'm trying to figure out at this moment at this moment, I don't give a fuck about what's going on. I don't wanna know why everybody yet. I wanna know why white do rag shot this man. So Blue and Ben say he'd be behind that table, but they know white do red in the person he shot. Ben said we need a killer like that on our squad. Well, you need to tell people so I think you do. That's me. Is it the next day? Wait a minute. They didn't I I just had to re go back and let you know they didn't pay their tab. Nah, I can go back to the movie. I don't know why I just need to let you know they didn't pay their tab, but they didn't pay their tab. Like, these, like, I don't even know how much they had to drink or how much they had to eat. I just know they didn't pay the tab. And I know Blue was asking about, you know, the tab. So technically, this, 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 this the tab not being paid, that's not on Blue. That's, that's all on Bean. Okay? That's all on Bean. And here's some class of attitude. Ain't nobody got time for that. Okay? Okay, they in a red van. Blue is a driver and red, Bean is riding shotgun. Now don't get me wrong, Blue is being nigga. Blue being nigga, and there's gonna be there's gonna be a time where I'm thinking, I'm gonna be thinking like, oh my god, Bean is gonna replace Blue, and then I'm gonna be sad, but then it's all gonna work itself out, okay? Blue see white do rag walking down the street. Boom, Bean calls out to white do rag, and white do rag starts fooling at them. He's like, pop pop. That's clearly how I've seen it. Even though I don't worry. I'm I'm gonna read to you. I'm gonna read to you. I know I am. No, you can't ask. Okay. I said no, you can't ask loyalty from people who are trying to eat like you trying to eat. I feel like this will be important later, so I'm gonna say it now. I say when it was bulletproof, uh, they used fake bullets, which didn't leave a mark at all. I didn't leave a scratch on the window. They asked him what's wrong with him, but I don't think he heard them. Now beans know his name and tell him to put the gun up. Why does he have? Why does he still have a gun? He just murdered someone with. <laughs> Don't worry. My thoughts, my thoughts say out the window and not make sense whenever you hear them because that's all that's happening. Blue, who nickname is Baby Boy. And then I say he blue because Baby Boy is already a movie. And I don't know if I'm going to do that movie, but I might because, you know, that be my second movie we said we we had say property we had to say property i know y'all like, you, you say one you gotta give me those numbers because you might not have to give me those numbers i'm not because i might i literally might want to do say property too just so i see that thing. now don't get me wrong i'm not i'm not trying to be over there on jcb because he married but 
I'm just saying between Jay Z looking all sexy and um um Blue looking sexy. That's all I'm there for. Technically, I'm only there for Blue, but you know, Jay Z was young, he was sexy. I'm make sure. So I was just root for him to be outside. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how I'm there. And he be talking hot, give a hot headache. So I'm gonna just root for him. I'm gonna root for him. <laughs> yeah, like Royce Reese, does she need you with my nigga? She probably don't, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Blue yell out who they are, like white. Nah, okay, so Blue yell out. He like, hey man, it's your, it's your, ba- it's your boy, baby. It's baby boy and, and beans, man. Like white blue rag know who they, know that, know who they are. So white blue I walked up to beans window. He like, my bad, my bad. Beans like, fuck damn. White dude like, white dude like, like, my bad, man, my bad. Beans like, man, it's me. White dude I go to, then they shake up and say, what's up? Because at this point, I was I was really tired of being a white dude right being, my bad. Beans being like, what up, man? What the? I'm just like, it's too much. Can you, can you? Speed it up. Speed it up. Speed it up. And it was just like, nah, we're going to take our fam right here. What up? Being like, hop in and let me holler at you. Oh, my God. Beans, Beans never is going to just say what the fuck he wants. He's going to piecemeal the shit out of what he wants to do. That's going to get annoying. This man is going to be our piecemeal. Beans acting like he had clout and power before he had ego. I mean, I, I guess so. Yeah. Okay. Mike, okay, okay, this is another thing I, I did, got, did piss me off low key. The pointless over talking. Like, there's a scene, it's a couple of scenes where I felt like the black director was saying, go. And everyone wants to, and everyone wants to get their line at the same time. That's it's literally how I feel. Okay. White Duet says, what's the deal? And B said, where you going? And White do I say, his girl, mom's house. But that tip, but that, hold on, hold on. I need, I need a moment. But that tip, that dude Tim, he violated and broke our code. I felt, at this moment, I felt like maybe I, I wasn't going to get the movie because I'm not a drug dealer. He said, you never fuck with a man's, a man's mom, his girl, or his kids, so we had to go. And I'm like, yeah, I totally agree with that. But what did he do? What did he do, writers? What did he do? Blue and being like, I feel you. I'm like, I don't feel him on this scene. I was, I was hoping to find out why he shocked him, but we would never know now. We just know it had something to do with something that he considered super important to him. Because he didn't fucking... Okay. Now I'm doing too much. Okay. Finally being say, look, I got a, I got a business deal for you. Because now, mind you, this is the reason why they had asked why do had to get in the car. Elijah, you finna end up getting sent to the room, because I know you know I don't like you walking around the circle. Thank you. And then he take a quick pause, and he say, I want you to be down with us. I don't know why, but I have to point this out. They, be, they just been sitting on the corner. They hear the police sirens and being say, let the murk out, and blue guys off. Literally, that's what being said. Being like, let's work out. And I'm like, what? I hope I don't got these drug dealers on the finished movie. So we say, same red van, they ride up on a guy named Peanut. Being say, what's going on? And Peanut say, ain't nothing going on right now. And being say, yeah, that's crazy, cause the smoke was all up and all up and through him. And Peanut say. I know, and I'm out here, but I'm not the only one out here. So they're not going to tell us 
where he got the drugs from. But he got drugs and basically gave them to street dealers to make money for him. And he, and they don't, and if, and if he don't make, and if they don't make his money to kill him, please tell me, please let me be jumping the line. That's what it was. That's what it was. I thought I was jumping the line. I wasn't. I wasn't. He's telling about some old guys who claim that it's his fault. And guess what? He walked out the stove. Make things simple. Don't want to have to look for the problem to handle. We didn't speak for the old man like they cool. Like, like, I understood. I understood. Like, some of these people, I swear to God, I'm still up. I was watching the movie and I was like, yeah. You just got to die right now because being being playing you. Being okay. Being speaks to the old man like that cool because he he what's good. Old man complains like his food spits it out. Being asked the old man to let him holler at him. He say. He said the old man because that's his man not old man. He say let me holler at you. And <laughs> this is my part. And old man say if you want to holler at me, you get out the cop. And you give me the proper respect like a man. Oh my God. What? Yeah, you about to die. Now let's see. Really? You have to be about to die. That's not true. Beans gets upset and starts talking trash under his breath. Oh man, it looks nice to me to use with young blood about to kill you because you want him to respect you. Bean gets out and says, Say, it says, they say you out here short stopping my business. And old man says, you just can't come up in someone else's business. This is my business. And it's going to stay my business until the day I leave this earth. Dig me? And B say, like a shovel. And that's what he was thinking. He was like, Blue gets out with a with a with with guns and tells the young dealer not to move. Oh, you like wasn't it just peanut? No, 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 no. I said a young guy, but actually it was two dudes, uh, two young guys that walked out with the old man. So it it is a little weird that they got a gun to an old man head this moment. Cause I swear to God, I reworked this thing twice just to make sure, just to make sure Blue put a put the gun to peanut head. As he was walking the fuck up, the gun was to peanut head, and one of the guns was to red shirt. And then when he got closer, he turned, he he reached for it, and he raised the gun on peanut chest. He like, and then give gun to peanut. And I'm probably like, damn, that probably hurt. It, but whatever, he gave the gun to peanut, and then um they start pushing the oh, I'm I'm going too fast. Okay, there's two guys standing in front of the store, but Blue still put a gun to peanut head. Where did Beans get a bath from? Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, this shit is annoying. So my internet is deciding to be shitty. Because, why not? <laughs> Okay, let's see, 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 see. Oh my god, this is the map on Oh my god, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. What the fuck are you doing? I know y'all like, see, why are you talking cussing at your kid? Why is my, my kid acting so slow? Okay. So, I'm going to have to improvise these next couple pages because the internet wants to be retarded and I don't have time for that. Okay, so, where did Beans get the bat from? I don't know. But Beans he has to get the bat. He gets the bat. He gets, um, he pulls the bat out. Now, mind you, once again, they was over talking to each other. This is really fucking irritating. Um, they was over talking to each other. 
old man like, what you doing? What you doing? And Blue Blue was like, um, oh my God, hold on, let me see. Blue Blue. Okay, y'all, give me a minute. Y'all can't see my eyes. It was so good. Y'all can't see my balls. You hold the judge me. Like, you hold the judge me. Why is there so much space in there? Y'all can't see my eyes. Y'all can't see my eyes. Y'all can't see my eyes. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. There's about to be a whole cut in this bitch. Not that it matters. Okay. Okay, so if I can, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, being said to everyone, it's sales from everyone in the competition. So they're going to get like, you know, they're going to get down and lay down. Blue says, I feel you, but we're going to need some folks to resolve. Wait, they're about to become drugs. They're about to become drug lords with the team. They took together last minute. Yep, nothing can go wrong with, of course, it can. Grown men, drugs, and weapons. Sell destruction. Go back to the movie. Showing the naked ladies. It was still at this point. It was. It was. That's the page I didn't read to you at that point. Okay, so give me a minute while I make this shit make sense because Jesus, it does not. And I know you're like, shit, does it not make sense? It doesn't. My kid wants to do all this extra shit in my ear. I don't know why because he wants to yell at him, but it's okay. Why is there so many gaps between them? I feel in my head. This shit is making me mad. I hope you end up on corner for me. Ooh, I don't want to be a drug dealer tonight. Okay. Okay. So it should not mess up because I took it off the internet. I literally took it off where it was the internet. Let's make sure we got all pages. Because, trust me, the internet really, really, really did a number on this thing. But whatever. Okay, it's all here. It's all here. It's all here. We're good. We're good. We're good. It's not as many pages as they're trying to make it seem. Fuck them for trying to make it seem long. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, we passed this. We passed our list. Uh -huh. Okay, we over there. White, white, do right is part of the gang now. So it's three of them. Make things simple. Don't want to have to look for the problem to handle. Okay, well, I read that. He's playing by the pool. Old man about to be killed. Um, you know, old man just. Okay, yeah. We get to the part where he's just like, you can't come up in my business. This is my business. Ain't nobody gonna see him. Ain't nobody gonna take, just gonna say my business because of damn you deserve it. He's like, a Gucci, shovel. And then I was upset about the gun to the man head. I got over that. Okay, so there were two guys. Okay, got over that part. Uh, where did Beans get a bath from? I said, this movie is like GTA in a way. What bitch appear out of thin air? People popping up when you need, we need it. Um, and everybody got a line, so it's gonna sound like several people speaking at once. A lot of the movies. Blue gets Tina the gun and pushes old guy toward the Abbey. Then with his magic back. <laughs> ah, because that bitch came out of nowhere. Um, points at the extras and red shirt. And red shirt falls down without even being touched. Like this boy is just extra as hell. He tells them not to go anywhere. I'll probably go to Rand. Fuck that. Ain't 
Ain't nobody. There's only three of them. They can't. They can't beat up dude in the back and watch us. I low key would have ran away since I know they about to kill my boss. Oh man, they screaming. What you doing? Like he don't know he about to die. Once again, everybody talking. Old man begging for his life and dude telling him to walk. He like, B, you don't have to do this. It's enough in it for the both of us. Nope. You said you gotta take a dirt nap for this to be. So good night. Beans, you gotta get his piece because he just loves you, my secret. So that's where you're wrong. It's only enough for me and Matt. We're not eating on the same plate with nobody. Well, you wasn't eating, that's why you up here, so. Beans came up there to bitch and peanut because she wasn't moving the weight. So whatever. She said, get on your knees. And she's hitting him in the knees with the bag. Wait. Oh man, it's heavy. Can you make him get up? Get in the trash can first? I'm lazy. And it was so this whole movie. More old man begging and being like, shut up. Instead of just beating him to death. Too much talking when they should be killing. If those two guys, young boys, are still standing in front of the store, sigh. I'm not going to. This thing is pointless if he's if he about to kill old man because no one is going to know about this speech. So he give out. He tell us, he get his whole speech about, this is my city. Woo, 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 woo. I make the rules. Okay. But he going to make the rules, and he going to break the rules. And I'm just like, what? what is the point of killing this old man? Is he going to kill him? Or whatever. And he breaking the old man's face. Yeah, he beats old man to death. <laughs> <laughs> like five minutes of him beating old man, old man body, and talking stuff. This just was not needed. Like, they showing people reactions to them seeing old men being beaten to death. Like, you see Blue and Peanuts reacting out like, as blood is flooding. I'm just like, listen, I'm, like, they not going to be the one cleaning up this mess. I would have been stalking. Like, shorty, sir, I, I, if you beat his head to a bloody pup, then I, I got to pick a brain matter. Mm-mm, too much. I would have stopped him because I don't want to pick a brain matter. She said I was going to wrap the body up and put it in the trail. DNA everywhere. Yeah, I'm, 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 yeah, I'm that one. I am that person that points out that if you are committing a crime and you're not wearing gloves, you got to get caught, bitch. You are about to get caught. Point, point, lock down. Don't call me. Um, I will say I got the jail number on lock, but I know she's been in the in this, she's just doing time, so. No, nah, it's not a lot. My number's not a lot. You just don't know it. Okay. So, um, Beans is like, at this point, Beans is like, clean this mess up. And Blue and Peanut start to pick the man up. Now, don't get me wrong, they are struggling because it's a big man. So, they struggling, and Bean moves Blue out the way. Like, move. Just literally grabs, grabs Blue from under the body and just uh, yanks him out, grabs the body with his other hand as he's shoving blue out of the motherfucking way. He grabs him, he grabs and he like helps Peanut put the body in the trap. So Bean was getting points from being a good friend. You know what I'm saying? Even though, you know, she beat that buddy to death. So I mean technically he should be the one to clean with his fucking mess. But okay. I said they got blood all over them, and they got DNA all over the body, and a whole crime scene. But I guess nobody said they body. I'm just gonna say that. This was the end. Boy, so one year later, you're like, so we, what happened? Why would we just go from them beating a the man? So they just wanted to believe he beat this man, and all of a sudden he was like, he took over the city. Apparently, apparently, being being cat calling his lady. She's clearly his lady, so she ain't giving him no no chances. I guess she still don't know how many boys, but she like, I don't want to I don't wanna be hollered at. Then he say her name, but she don't answer. She said, why are you playing with me? Her response is, you know I don't mess with no brother. And I'm just like, why is she so upset? Because she, okay, so this is how this conversation went. She said, you know I don't mess with no brother. And he like, I'm not no broke dude. And she says, what's that, baby? And I'm just like, did you just hear this man get a super aggressive with you? Is he not listening? Because he just, he deep voiced you. 
he 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 voiced you. I'm talking about deep deep voice now. I can't I can't deep voice you like he deep voice. I can't even know. She softens up a little when they kiss. They do a close up on her face as she asks her where she's coming from, and she says shopping. Now, if this is supposed to be, this is I guess this is supposed to be set up the scene to make it seem like, you know, beans be tripping on his bitch. Really? Does he? I don't. I don't think so. She was asking her questions that she was thirsty to answer. And he say woo, and she say Tanya. Tanya. Does he not trust her? What's with all the questions? She better ask questions. She don't. She telling her friend want her to go out with her tonight. Now it's gonna be funny because this would be the only time that he acts. I'm gonna be quiet. This would be the only time that she asks being for permission to go out, but this will not be the only time that she goes out. Okay. Make sure you understand that. Is this her man or her daddy? She tells a friend that her and Beans might get something to eat, and he say, no, nah, you might as well go with go with her, because she got something to do. Yep. So she got to meet Blue later, and she say, you sure, because she's not trying to hear it tomorrow. What she wear? What she, who you talk to? Beans laughing. Considering he just gave her the fifth degree when she was just shopping, she was a lot, but okay. She say, do you want me to go to the club or not? And he say, Get the fuck out of here. She tell her to go to the club because she not worried. And guys know what time it is for him. She say, anyway, the city mine. Now don't worry, this this is not his city, but whatever. You kill one guy and think the city is yours. Okay. His girl might be in danger. That's I I just felt like her, her life might be in danger. And um later on that would be just creepy. Deep. So for me right. He said, ain't no what belong to me. And then I say, well, somebody came out from. Yep, I did. I know that people in the back are like, I thought she saw this. Well, it's been a minute. She looks sad, she looks sad and he say, what's your problem? What's wrong with you? And I'm like, only one of those is me. They're like, what's your problem? What's wrong with you? Same person. She says, she be worried about him. She just want him to be careful. She know these dudes respect him, but she be worried about him. So she know what he do. So I'm like, so she knows she he do to get money. I'm worried too, cause money will turn a lawyer man to a snake real quick. She say, don't worry about him, cause he got everything on the show. I'm worried about. You. I'm not. Wor- I, wor- I don't see. I don't, yep. I saw. I brought it right here. I said I'm not worried about. I'm worried about the people around you. To be honest, now, well, I wasn't worried for a being. She said, because Beans always had control of the situation. I was worried about the people around him who, how should I put this, who felt they knew what was going on, but in actuality had no clue about what was happening popping off around them. That's how I'm put it. I, the fact that they do a close up on her face is annoying me because she's talking to someone. And they right in front of her. So why they acting like she's on the phone? Because I swear to God, they kept doing it. Like, like she's literally talking to them. And every time Bean says something, they just zoom in on her like her mouth. Like this. So you get a scene where it's just her mouth. And then it just zooms back out. And it's like, wow. She says, you sure? He says, you know I am. You know I'm sure. The fact that you close, okay, I already said that. She says, you love me? She says, you know I love you. She got a peanut head and they walk off. So red shirt is still wearing a red shirt a year later. So I want to be petty. With two white shirts. And I know you like kids. Why do you not know one's name? I told you. My brain. This is the best you can do. Okay. It's his city, but he don't have control of it. But it's not his city. So what had ended up happening was he took over the west side and she felt like she owned the whole city. I don't know. That's what happened. A lot. How does this work?
could a drug dealer like drop it in the comments? Like I well, don't just don't. Okay. So far it's only three guys in the crew, beans, blue, and white do rack. They hop up and walk up to young fellas to be young fellas on the block. They look like they're about to murder someone. They did. Actually, it's four. I'm, I got it wrong. I, I don't know why I wasn't counting peanuts. So, it's the p three people that walked up when they walked up on the, these young fellas is blue bean and peanut and white do red. Is it there? Well, wait. Okay. He walked up to Snoop and started filling on his pocket. Like, the the amount of people that Bean thought he was going to hold, mind blown. Mind blown. So I filling on his pocket, say, say, saying, you get plenty of money. Snoop puts his hand away, don't want to be friends. I guess you got to back. Snoop say, what's up? That was, that was me. Snoop says, what's up? And once again, Dean's got to get a seat. I can't even talk business. And Snoop like, then talk. I'm listening. Dean's gets mad and says, I'm going to give you the opportunity of a lifetime. I'm going to give you a chance to get down with us. He don't ask if they selling for themselves or they pushing for someone. He don't ask. If they if they only if they the only ones in control of the block, this man Beans is out here or hot headed like a motherfucker. He's trying to take. It's not adding up at this point. Snoop say, "What you mean, get down with y'all?" And Beans like, "You know." And I'm I'm like, "No, he don't, or he wouldn't have asked what you mean." Beans say, "I give you work and you report the blue, and everybody gets this money." Truthfully, no wrong man. This is a sad note. It's a, like I said at this point, hella sad note. Truthfully, no grown man would, would like to have that sale. You want me to do the work, put my life in jeopardy, and my freedom at risk, while all you do is sit back and collect the money? Oh, hell no. He said, he said we need to get this money together, because he hit him. Once again, he touched Snoop Hodges like he don't respect him. Snoop about to sue Jeff over making money to do. Snoop say, I got my own thing, and I'm doing good on my own, and he don't need no help. Then he say, you going to get in or wait in? And all these figures, where's Beasley and the from? Because he didn't have no money or anything in the beginning. Snoop pushes past them and runs down the street. Bean, Blue, and Peanut start waving signals to White do that. Now, this part could have been great. It probably would have. Could have been. Could have, could have, could have, would have. Y'all like, the people in the front are like, Chief, are you okay? And I'm just like, I don't know. This could have been good. But the point of the matter is, you can't control how someone is running. So at the end of the day, White Durag would have no clue that Buddy was going to keep running straight and go down that second block for him to come be, come out the alley and hit dude with the butt of the gun. Dude literally ran two blocks that way. If he had hit him right after he got through with that first block, he would have literally got away. I say, will someone pop up? Is this a GTA moment? Guy running for two blocks and right dude where I got the right power to appear in two places at once and hit dude in the face at the end of his gun. Why not just shoot him? Overkill. It shows the other two who have moved and are standing to next to a gate. He said, same offer for you. What's he going to be? I wish I both them. Because beans killed their first boss and they didn't go to work for beans. They went to sleep. But they get down his camera around. Doing that. He say, get a guy some pet. No one does. Blue and Peanut are too busy trying to walk to the car looking for Like he tell them to get them some work and these niggas just go like hmm. and walk to the car. Now why gave you a job? He got a mansion. So basically he killed people and moved a lot. He's not in the city. Boys probably feel some type of way. Cause he wanted his family safe and they still in danger with, with their family. It's the daughter, fifth birthday. The day in which he would spend more time with the daughter. How long has he been selling girls? What's the cover story for the money? 
or the police watching? Does BM have a job? Or does all she do is go shopping and clubbing? Is there money put up for the rough time? Why every time BM comes, they switch to do a face shot? I'm sorry, y'all. I, I had to ramble that one. <laughs> he said he captured his family first as the BM is complaining about him neglecting them. Like, this nigga stop doing that. I be extra for my family. I give him extra. I can fast everything. I can fast all of me. He's over there like, oh my god, you know, he could be the best. He could be the best lover. He could be the best father. But I just want him to spend time with his daughter because she believes. She believes in he is a, he he is an angel. He is a god child. Let me stop. Ready? They're going to the street. He said, when you be. When you be behind that trigger, you always say, damn, I got a family at home. And that's it. And I say, and that's not, and that's it. Now this person might have family that could put my, my family life in danger because I kill someone they love. Mm-mm. Not the wrong part. They blow the, cam- the cameras up. The kids say yay. And the blue, and blue walks down the stairs. Bean looks disappointed. Why she looks upset because Bean's crew were in the house sitting at the bar drinking. It's this guy that was in jail. A friend before he started eating is always going to believe you owe them a place. And that was the case. You don't believe, okay, let's see if this jail bar, the beginning to the end. And he was. Okay, so they did a close up of Blue, and he was a little upset. And I don't know why, I, at this point, I'm trying to like make it seem like maybe Blue would be the trigger. You know, the love of my life. So I was, I was going to have to do this jail for him. Maybe he worried about that being gonna put Jeb on the spot. Who do who do you think gonna be this loyal? Drop it in the comments. I'm gonna give you five minutes. You gonna drop it in the comments. You niggas. Okay, so Jail Bates' real name is Blitz. Cause they don't know I'm talking about his real name. Jail Bates is Blitz and Blue. That's Baby Boy. So who who you think is gonna be this loyal? Who gonna get that snake skin? Mm-hmm. Okay. Jebboy was cute, you know. Okay, uh, quick as hell. Dean says, dude always acting like they hard, when if he don't, they be chilly. Dean said they respect them like the old, okay, Blue said they respect them like the old black mob. And Dean said they gonna respect them like the new black mob. Dean was standing at the door looking upset. Why is she looking like she don't like his crew? They just came up with a cool name. ABM, which does not stand for New Black Murder, so I don't know where that came from, but okay. Okay, they just saw the guy in glasses. Too many guys are looking this way. Oh, well, but no, nah, he wasn't dead. No, he was dead. Then he puts the glass away and says, get out of here. BM just stood at the door for eight minutes and walk off mad, but I think he didn't see her. Will they fight later? Hmm, off camera probably. More of them all, all over talking to each other. So in the hood looking bad, Bean and his crew about to take over. Another block with these cops, but these, but these cats is older than Snoop, and it's more than just two guys on the block. It's young guys and teens hanging out on this block. They do a close up on the Lincoln, the Lincoln SUV. Then so 55 puts a homeless man. Okay, we want to die. Then 55 grabs a homeless man by the neck and push him again. Yes, then shoot him in the face with no speech if you can help it. 55 walk up to his week and say, what's up, kid? You need something? Beans was disgusted. Beans said, what I need? Do I look like I smoke crack? He about to give a speech. 55 says, you and your man, you and your man roll up here. What you need? And Beans run his brother's chin. 55 don't know who he is. Then he said, what I need you to do is to rip him a mattress. So you know 55 not the head man in charge. So Butter Bean came through and he went to talk to him. 55 like, he know you? Bean say, no. Nah, he don't know me, but he needs to. Okay, we just talk about blue and the faces. Uh, uh. 
Oh, I read that. When he introduced Jailbait. Okay, so I'm gonna talk about being faces because he he was just I mean not being being the blue faces that he was making because he was making some very he worked for that money he worked for that cash. Good acting skills because I'm getting a feel I'm getting a feeling like he feel I'm getting that I'm getting the vibe that he feels some type of way and he's not happy with the way. Being in handling things, I could be wrong, and I hope so, but I'm positive. It's a reason the director keeps showing us his facial expression. Let me just say this now: blue, blue loyalty never switched up. White, blue, red loyalty never switched up. Peanut, peanut loyalty never switched up. Take what you want from that, but their loyalty never switched up. Even if I say it, that they probably will. Being select like a money just to say, make sure he called me at this number and make sure he gets it. So if you get super fast some money with a card, did he just write his number on the bill? Would have been cool if they showed that, but he didn't. He just, that's why he gave me a card. Ooh, that's my hair. Let me play speed up, y'all. Like, it would have been cool if they saw Dean giving the plan on how they were going to take over the second block instead of white dude looking like he had. Superpowers in this bitch. Super speed. He said he expected to hear from him in 24 hours. Of oh, what? Why do I need to know what's going on, what's going to happen if he don't call? Because it seems pointless. He decided to get out the car and they drive off so I'm blue looking like he not going to do his move. Okay, so this is a sad character. He don't get no name. He just needs to be extra. Extra as 55 who those dudes be. 55 say some dudes some guy named Dean, and now he got a recap of the conversation that just happened. 55 say he won't bother to call him, and extra say why. And 55 say, how should I know? And that's a problem. I was just someone's business. And extra say, say, be glad I'm concerned. And I'm like, guys, he was all the way in the back. He literally was all the way in the back, and he literally had to like make his way to the front to even be known. I'm like, if he got shot, you would have been able to do nothing, and you wouldn't. Okay, you wouldn't have been able. You wouldn't have been a witness because you don't want to be like with a snitch. Then butter pulls up. Beans only had to wait five minutes. Happen butt up as soon as she get up. Not nah, as she's getting up. The car. Like she be fine. Walks up to the side and he's like, "Oh my man's butter. You get in that bread. You get it. You took in that bag. Oh my gosh, butter." Nobody does it better than you, butter. And then butter gets out the car and he keeps going. Like, like, what are you being paid to be the hype man? Like, huh. butter get out the car and fifty five. Say I need to holler at you. She says some kids were looking for you and they just pulled off. But it says everyone looks for him and seriously. Who? Fifty five say he left the car and he say you paid him in twenty four hours or he gonna get with you. He gonna he gonna he be he gonna be getting with you. I feel like I need to be a drug dealer to understand the talk. Like but again the car said his extra and asked if he heard beans and the extra say not that I can think of. So beans ain't to go over the city. Making a statement to his GM hold no way. And butter say no one know him. But he want me to pay him in 24 hours, and 55 say he just delivered a message, and I like the message. Yeah. 55 say he don't look like he was playing either. Sue him for making this seem like another dude shady butter. Butter is like I'm trying to see who this dude is. I'm like just arm up and be ready to if he wants what's yours, and he don't mind killing to get it. Butter say what's he riding in? 55 describe his SUV. And says he had a BM on the back. And then asked know who he is. He said that's the boys that took over the West Side. But I say what? What they want to talk to me for? And I should say what you see? They want part. And but I say they gotta get they weight up crazy before they come mess with me. No, they they're not. Cause he know they don't want no drama. And she be sad like 
but you go on a page him, shoot him because he sounds scared and he don't and we don't we don't, we don't have fear in our heart. But like I'm gonna holler at this man to see what's up with him. They dib up, they dab up, and he's tail fifty five. Good looking out. Oh, so sorry. I need to give myself 20 minutes. 55 has the money that Butter had given him with the car. 55 is not to be trusted. Why did Butter even come to the block? Then he yelled at the black boys for sitting around, even though they were sitting there when he pulled up and doing a whole conversation he had with 55. Butter had no reason to show up there besides to have the story alone. We had the mansion now, being blue, and another dude. I in the mood just hanging out where glasses is. Greens look like he rolling up and blue look just it. But a but a call while he get he getting a massage. No brother brothers text it while he was getting a massage by chick. With no shirt on. You gotta let us know he be focused on the females more than anything else. I mean, that's not how they used to take butter down, so whatever. So butter take beans, butter beans. His number. And beans saw butter, and he's like, who is this? That's how butter asked the phone. He's like, who is this? And beans like, you know who I be? Butter said, I heard you wanted to holler, so holler. Beans like, you don't got to be so defensive. And he just want to talk, so she got a business deal for him, that's all. The amount of whole rap songs snuck into this movie. But it says my business is good. It's good, fast. What you want? You want me? Not now. So what the fuck? So what the F I talk? You could offer me. Since Esther told him that's what he wants this conversation is away from this killer. He says, I'll give you opportunity of a lifetime. That's his favorite for this man. I'm going to give you opportunity of a lifetime. And get down or lay down. I'm just like, damn. You want to be right? I feel like beans know people would say no because this plan literally would turn the king to a black person too quick. Why would I try to start over under you when I make my own way? Bean said, buddy, he's going to get him chance to be a captain. So Butter works for somebody. No beans don't do this do this business. You know how strong the people Butter work for are? Butter say, why would I be a captain for you when I'm a general in my own spot? Bean say, because you want to live. This isn't smart to build your team off a bunch of guys who also want to hold the team spot. Butter says, what you saying? And Bean say, look man, you already know what it is. Either get in or lay in. Let's just do Bubba the Beans as Butter says, you know who you messing with. No, please tell us. Butter said that he run things and ain't no way they see him and F them because she going to see them in the streets. But if you see them in the streets, you literally they about to see you in the streets and they will know where you are. Well, I feel like the house bug. Butter and Beans hang up. Butter female asked him, is he okay? And he said, mind your business. Like, he just did not have this important fucking conversation with her house like a face. I would have been like, nigga, my nigga, no. Like, he just didn't have a important conversation with her. She rolled, her, she rolled him over, slashed down his body, cut the bean, but she knows she gave him head in the hair sex. But back to being in his guy. Complaining about butter. Uh, Blitz sitting next to beans instead of blue. I, I don't know why I was like, oh my God, look at being taking someone else besides my baby. And then I was like, baby, come a little head of my roof. I got to. So then I was like, why is glasses even there? Because Bean don't like him. And now he's picking on glasses. Our glasses were for sure. And now they ain't ha- now they ain't ganging up on him. Bean said, do your job, which I guess is rolling up. Bean throws the weed in. Which is I'm just making sure. I don't know what it we on the black. Glass doesn't glass doesn't even say anything, but blue like he really he really greasy. Beans beans tell him 
step. Ben's going off, call him a bitch, and Glass say, fuck you, I'm not doing anything. Putting the weed on the table, and then he say, he, and then he don't say nothing, he just stab He say he probably walked in the back. Everyone laughs, and Ben say, he's talking to you, boo. We say, I don't know, but he say, if you, and Ben say, get out of here. And I'm like, you heard him. Ben said, you don't shoot him. I'm not going to respect you. Ben said, you shoot him. I'm not going to respect you because you let Blue get in your head, which is true. He let, he let baby boy get in his head right here. Blue tell, tell, um, Blitz to shut up. And he gets up walking toward Glass and saying, you didn't say that, did you? I know, I would say no, because I, I want to, I do want to live. He grabbed Glass by the head, he got a bug hat on, and asked him, uh, Blue, what did he say? Blue repeated what he said, and then said him to shut up and break glasses. What he and and the man said, glasses say what he said. Right. Well, Okay, y'all, I had a little tea, just keep knocking the weight. Okay, but I'm almost done. I'm almost done. I know y'all like to see. What the fuck? I'm like, wait a minute, because there is so much you can do instead of watching him bully someone and throw his power around. He pushed his head in the air, asking him what he said. That's very shallow. So he ain't said a word because he don't want that too. Glass is not saying nothing, and Blue asks him, which is making Ben mad. Green tells Blue to shut up before he gets Glass is messed up. Green still yelling, what you say, and Glass is still not answering. Ben grabs a gun, and she's a question, and Glass say nothing, but Ben pointing the gun in his face, and still saying, what you say, just letting you know he heard, he heard him. When Glass says no, Ben says, shut up, and now Blue wants Ben to calm down. Blue like, you doing too much, homie. And to, to that, I say, fuck you, Blue. Kill glasses because you want to be a jokester. He asked him, which hand he roll up what, with while pointing the gun at him. Glass is like, no, everyone is talking. Biz is about to do something stupid because everyone else is, won't stop laughing at him. He still asked him, what hand he roll up? Biz said, you think I'm playing with you? What hand you roll up with? I think you playing. I think you playing at this point. You're not going to do it. Keep playing. I'll call this fuck. I'm dead. Yeah, I'll probably be bad. That would have most tied him up. So he just grabs his hand and asks Blue, is this the hand he roll up with? Blue like, I think so. Glass is trying to move his hand. Bean's like, don't move your hand. If he was just going to pick a hand, the eight minutes were not needed. I feel it. He put his hand back. Glass is say, nah, Bean. And Bean's like, didn't I tell you to roll up? Glass is like, no, Bean. Please, please. He might not shoot him in the hand, but Blue started laughing again. So now he has to shoot glasses. So Blue knows he's not no not a joke. He shoot him in the hand. Glass fall over. Holding his hand. Blue jumps off the couch like he got shot. Uh Blitz say you bugging. I'm surprised his neighbors didn't call the cops. So throw glasses of towel. Blue throws glasses of towel and Bean pushes some ice over to him. And they tell the man to roll up while everyone talking shit. Who hasn't sat back down on the couch like Glass is rolling up with his good hand? Bean say, Bean say, that man, that man, okay, cut your basketball game. So the audience cheering and the players playing. I'm like, if he's too butter, upset is not the word. I'll be speechless. Don't worry, I'll rest. I'm just about to be good. They say butter, they show butter chilling like Bean's just starting his life, like, 
He ain't got no peace on him. He's not prepared. Yeah, he got it. Yeah, he got his guys out there body calling, but I mean, you know, you go to security and securing shit, but is that really securing yeah, shit? Going back over the audience one more time. Joe's brother sitting down talking about the game. So two SUVs roll up. One, no one said that shit, just. They shoot into the game. Two guys get out the second SUV and the cameras crash back to the game and the referee blowing the whistle. Do a close up of, wrestle, of the referee chant and cut the 55, high five in the team. They shake up with butter and go over to the, go over the next part of the game. Charge back to the audience and Blue, Blitz, and Peanut are coming down the stairs. 55 should remember Blue since he was the one driving beans around. Fifty five is just not paying attention. Blue beans, I mean blue peanut and blitz walk down the stairs, but then they start pushing people out the way before they even put not their guns. But they pulled out their guns before they even start shooting. Like they literally had them machine in here. Do fifty five and butter not hear people yelling? Fifty five say those guys from the other day, he reached for his teeth, but he might not make it. Not might not be fast enough. They start shooting, but they got bad aim, so they don't hit anybody. But Butter literally goes and has behind his man because he don't have a gun. So Butter forgot his gun after Dean starting him. Okay. They show the crowd running. Everyone literally left. Like the only people that are there are the people that were shooting. Or that's what they want us to be right here. More shooting than 55 gets hit and goes down. The extra gets shot. I'm gonna your mom talk about how extra they fall, like white fur field court and backward. Don't ask me how it's possible. Then they shoot a third guy who was standing, standing with them and in the crowd, but they want to believe he was, oh, he was, he was with it. Okay, GTA. So, but it's part of the GTA universe because when the guy he was had in the hand got shot, Butter didn't run and fall. Butter. Ran and fell. He did not have a gun, but now he got one. Like, he ran and he fell. That's how he got shot in the leg. Because my man's went up in his leg when the at got shot. Somehow, my brother got shot in the leg. The guys had left and then being come up as a defense. Blitz killed Butter while, while being watched. I know Boo feels the type of way. He said, like, Butter Baby and Beans went and got an SUV. A lady appears out of thin air, screams, and runs away while being runs to the driver's side. I mean, he's still he didn't run. Everyone was standing around waiting on Blitz to shoot butter, but none were in the scene of being standing in front of the fence. So they appeared out of thin air just to run to the car. Sweaty started to cry over butter body. Did she not see anything? Like, what reason to leave her alive? What is he doing? Lay on the couch and don't talk. Boys over why they show the dead bodies and but a girlfriend trying to with his body. He called them fake gangsters, but he don't know who they work for, so I hope they don't kill him. He was over his shoulder. So he taking over the city. Blue got the west side on lock. Uh, Blitz taking over the north. And killing everyone who get in the way. Peanut running drugs out of Delaware and Riverside. He thinks he about to take over, but Blue out here being hot, hot headed. I thought he'd be hot headed. He wasn't. Blue bumps into officers and paid them. Bean says he's doing what the what the do is do. Yeah, he literally went on a little spree about doing what the do is do, taking what the papers take. Uh, being what the beaters be, um, hitting what the hitters hit. Yeah. You don't have to tell you to lay down. It is bedtime for you. Yeah, good night. Good night. You don't take the top 10. He's going too much out of his house where his family eat and they lay their heads at. Like, boom. I mean, beans. 
doing too much out of his house where his family even lay their heads at. Like, he makes it seem like he bought this house so his family could be safe, but now it's like every time you look up, him and the gang is in the mansion having a meeting. So all, all, your, all your crew, even the motherfuckers that's fake in this crew, know where you lay your head at. But okay. He's on the phone with his supplier. I guess they want him to wait. Okay, he got these suppliers now. He was kidding. Did he lose the supplier? Cause he said after you were hung up, you said what that what what that about? Like he wasn't listening to the conversation. Then he said they they say you gotta wait a week and talk about how money how much money you gonna lose. They say they need to get rid of the middleman and go to the man themselves. They didn't know his name, but how? When did they get back? When did the glasses thing, when they did the glasses thing, they could have showed us how they found the connection, how they found out who the big man was. That's, that's something that probably, everybody would probably want to see. And I, myself, that's who it is. Like, if you don't want to lay down, go home. Go home and spin the dark. It's, 12, it's almost 12 o'clock. They say they get, they're going to jump on a plane and just go see the man. Blue. Blue say he needs a vacation and then like after vacation, you got to chill. This isn't a game. You have some vacation. Blue like, okay, man. And how not you will you will take you have time because it's not gonna take long to make a break yet. They did they literally went down that came back. Did they go down that? I highly doubt it. Blue, the right hand man, the right hand, but I still feel like she's gonna she did it, so I'm not even going to read that. They go over the water. Blue and Beans pull up at a mansion. Beans is driving and Blue is riding. Why didn't they have the conversation the way over? Beans says they would be mad. Blue says he counted it. Beans says he's sure and Blue says he's straight. Beans says he won't, won't get in and out like a robber because he don't trust them. Blue say he don't, he don't either. They talk too fast. He don't, he don't trust them. They are talking people either. They go inside while Beans asked Blue why he went the small car. Blue said, I didn't rent anything. This is what he gave it to me. A black guy with a gun was guarding a set of double uh, double green doors. They go inside with Beans talking stuff about the guard. They use the Mexicans to talk about the flight. For someone who wants to get in and out, Beans is giving too long of answers. Messages ask if they want something to drink, then ask Blue what he wants to drink. Blue say what he wants, and the Mexican tells one, help one to get to get it, but Dean shuts him off and says they good aggressively. Why? I don't know. The Mexican looks confused, and Dean says, says to Blue, if you don't mind, we'll have drinks when we get home. And Mexican is like, I just want to be a good host. And then he's like, no disrespect, we just came to have a business, but at the same time, he was doing hella things. Let's look it up. Mexican say, wait right here. I'll be a minute in him and his guys, guards leave. Why didn't one guy say to watch them? As soon as they out the room, Blue and Beans get into it. They talk at the same time. Blue feels like Beans doing too much, and Beans like, we don't know them. When you talking about some drinks? He start. He says they just cut out the middleman, and for all they know, they got someone come kill them and take the money. So why would the Mexican people kill people selling his drugs like this? Part makes no sense. You going to sleep? What are you talking about? When you get up? Blue says, "If that's how you feel, then you push me with this cocky attitude." And Bean says, "Slow the f up. You tripping? Check your piece and make sure it's not on safety." Blue says his gun don't have a safety. B puts blue and say stay cool, stay cool out and come on. Where are they going? They watch the table, put the suitcase on the table, look around and make sure no one watching and then open the case. Why? He takes the gun off the money and puts it on his way. If they don't see someone, this scene will be pointless and it didn't have to see nobody for this scene. He will be pointless. They wait five minutes for him to fix his shirt. Ask Beans if he's good and Beans to say yeah. 
The guard didn't touch them, so this was not needed. Like, why wasn't your gun on you from the start? Mexican guards come back. Mexican says, okay, now you follow me. Beans is the one talking stuff, but he wanted to do like he the one. Messing up. They walk up and the guards follow behind them. They go to the pool pool where there are three, two females swimming. The third, the guy gets out of the water and asks the pool guy if he gets he get in. Guess no one told him about the meeting. He watched the guys walk out. He doesn't say anything until they're close enough. Then he says a little later because he has business to handle. And she says, okay, baby. At the same time, they watching the guy. As they walk by, they talk about the females. Beans is just being too rude and cocky for me. You cannot offer them them to get down or lay down. Mexican gives Boo a car. Beans tries to get in his chair. I mean, Mexican gives Boo a chair. Beans tries to get him his chair, and Mexican is like, no, you sit. So Beans does, but you know he's doing him on because he don't like it. Mexican say, Boo, you still want that drink? And Beans says, sure, why not? Mexican says, because your friend is a little nervous. Bean sits up and, but before he go off, because he like, I'm not nervous. Say anything, we'll say they from out of town, so they want to be safe. Bean says, F the nervous, and let's have a business, and Mexican says, okay. Are you really choosing a wine because you got to go to bed? Okay, cool. Mexican tells Guard two who whistle and some guys bring the guns out. Beans do it do too much. She acts like she's rushing them. She said that's what I'm talking about. They says drugs at the Mexican feet and they say let's do business. So who is pool guy and why do we have to come out here? Mexican put the drugs on the table and be and beans says talk English. Nigga, you supposed to be in Mexico. You stop giving us food and you supposed to fill in your face, my nigga. Come out from speak English. Nigga, speak Mexican. Speak Spanish. The disrespect. Blue put the work in the vial and shake it up. It turns blue and he has the beans. Beans put some on the gun. Blue says it's the best. They show full size face close up and beans says it's okay. Blue and Mexican clap it up and beans says now we in business. I just want to point out the Mexican being talked to being because he was disrespectful and acting scared. The Mexicans count the money. So far, the Mexican is the only one touching anything, which is smart. Mexican says blood money, and being says you should like that, and Mexican says yeah, you like that. No, Mexican says that's the only type of only kind of money there is. Mexican says he looks he looks forward to doing business with them and Bean says you too pappy, more disrespect, and Bean says, Let's get the F out of here. The Mexicans from breaking bad, you have killed Bean. Sorry, not sorry. Mexican says, Wait, aren't you forgetting something and ask about the drink? If the Mexican was trying to shoot, he would have killed both because by the time he had put his hand on the gun, the Mexican can retaliate one out of his can. Bean says, next time, the Mexican says, you in a rush and they're going to miss the show. They didn't miss the show. It shows the two ladies making out. There are people, poor side girls, so they won't be giving any to the other three guys, but the director said, more. Make chicks, chicks make out more, kill the baby. I am so close to any y'all. I'm so sorry, but it look like it's going to be long. Voice over. Um, Brown suitcase is, is two pieces. His name is too long, so forgive me. As a new young blood trying to make a name for himself, his friends ask him where they setting up shop because ABM all over the place, all over the place. And he says, F them ABM cats, F being, F blitz, this I block. We going to get this. Money, no jail bait, shoot things down. Two P says, What you trying to man? The chair says, That's right. This out here, we grew up around here. 
So ain't nobody moving anything but us. Pointing, pointing out there is uh, using that deceiving Jimmy line. Scooby says get, get the guys together and have them on the block 24-7 and having them serving the things. Who else will they go on that need to study pressure? Why are they outside on the block with no guns and no money and no drugs? They did clap back and leave. They, they didn't they clap hands and leave back to Ben's house. Us on the phone and Bliss walk up sharing garden how nice being spot is. Esther says, "Well, this is not Esther. This is like you guys. Why do I like man? Like like blue like man? All that bread been beginning. What's up with that?" Because, okay, all Nasser was saying was, oh my goodness, he hooked the spot up. Like, he took his money, he did what he was supposed to do with it, and he hooked the spot up. Then it's like, we don't, we don't want us to put him in the work. The souls and the beans, is, and, and beans is eating. They're the killers in the street. Beans ain't no killer, because he got them bagging them up. Since day one, they found some snake skin. This is so sad. They say, if we had the connection, we would blow it up. That's why do I say beans is just back, huh? As we talking beans, beans getting all the money. Beans just looked at him like, like you look like a yes man. As to say he bought you a hat, you from a have not a have not to have. And Blue says, I'm an ambu. Why do I say he get, he bought you from a have not to have? And then Bliss says, but we good. So F all that trust, F all that. That's what his solution was. Like, but we good, so F all that. And he said all that as uh, Beans walks up. He calls Beans boss. Beans says Bliss to meet with Blue and call him. When he gets there, he says, okay, boss man. Bean says, what's wrong with him? Talking about boss man. Why do rags say you got to keep an eye on him? He say, why and ask, why do rags say because he hating on you? Hard saying you don't only want to get your money. He's trying to hook up with the connects and everything. So is it snitching if you tell one guy about the next guy hating on him? Drop it in the comments. Bean says he got a new car. He iced out and everything. Why do rag like that what he said? And Bean's just like, that's what I don't like. And we want to tolerate having a snake ass person in the family. He tell white blue rags to keep an eye on him because he got something for it, for that ass. They show a young lady walking down the street with beans doing a voiceover calling her a whore. She looking at the lollipop and licking her lips. They do a close up on her mouth, but they did a close up on the rest of her mouth, so I'm not upset. So they use the females to take guys down now. Okay, I see you, movie. Bliss goes and talks to Two Piece. Two Piece says, I heard, I heard you F with ABM. Bliss says something like something like that. Two Piece says, You come to threaten me. Bliss says, Beans know this old spot, and they came up with a peaceful solution. He makes his own move, but ABM was 10%. I wouldn't know. No. Two Piece says, 10% of what I make, tell Beans to suck my. Bliss says, that's your word? Just that story you walk up. I mean, because Beans gave a voice over, we know. Shorty a plant. The reason Two Piece and Blends want to get murdered, but back to the movie. Two Piece pushed Shorty back and he said he was just leaving. Bliss, yeah, he right, watching Shorty a little too close. Bliss say, I'm going to see you later, player. And Two Piece say, tell Beans to suck my D. Two Piece say, What's up to Shorty and you in that man's face like you know him or something? She going, she is doing this to the lollipop. Yes, she gets an A for her acting. She tells him he's jealous and he like, I know you. She say whatever and he asks her what she want and her she responds with, you don't remember? She say what? She say you supposed to give me some money to get my hair and nails done. She grabs about her arm and walks two steps away from the guys. They can still hear him. Only say, what the fuck? 
Every time I turn around, you got your hand out. She said, every time I turn around, you got your D out. So what's good? She gave her the money and say, you piss me off when you do that and, and do that around my friends. He smack on, on behind and say, make sure you have your palm in by 10. His, his guy say, damn, man. And two people say, she got my ass forever back to the mansion. So why do rag want one big and he go crazy? Because now he got security camps, the house is bugged, and he, well, I'm saying house is bugged, I don't know if house is bugged, and he asked him to know what to do with his gun now. He put it up right before he get ready to open the door, then he forget how to open the door, that was kind of funny. It's Bliss, and they talk about two pieces, but Bliss was supposed to be blue, which was never did, or did, didn't forget that Blitz, that he told Bliss to meet Dean. Yeah. Uh, she said I can watch something, but now it was clear. Okay, when I'm done, you watch little TV before you go to bed, because you need to take this week anyway. Alright? Okay. How many minutes do you have? Uh, how many minutes I got? You're not letting me finish, so let me have you get done. Mm-hmm. Beans and Bliss come up with a plan to take two piece down. So two pieces get taken down, and then Bliss just falls. They cut to Bliss and two piece girl having sex. I'm gonna get some time to pass. Bliss says, I gotta make you mine. And Troy say, that she do not my man, because she needs someone who can provide for her. He tell her he need her to do a favor for him, and she say anything he wants to do. She say, check this out, and she's undoing his plan, which leads him to say, never mind, I'll tell you in a minute. Voice over. Half the movie, Beans ain't cared at all, and now he using pay phones to act and scare all because what this is supposed to be a snake, I guess. I don't know. It's supposed to be a snake. The movie, you know, snake got tipped in. And then, guess who called the police? It was Bean. Yeah. Does that make Bean a snake? Because Bean was the one that called the police to snake on his man. Dropped out in time. So is Bean going to call? So is Bean's going to call Two Piece and tell him Shorty messing around with Bliss? And P Two Piece goes see Bliss, and the police pull up Two Piece leaving, and they kill him. Let's see. It's another day. Two Piece is driving Shorty somewhere. They stop, and Two Piece tells Shorty to hurry up. He don't have a lot of time. She say, I'm about to treat you to something real special. She about to get killed. She lick her lips and he say, just hurry up. And then she get out the car. Why well, said, I'll be right back. She look back at him. And he's too busy watching her booty, so he not paying attention to the surroundings. He play with the radio and shorty gets to the door and look back at Blitz. So Blitz is going to see two pieces and the police is going to pull up. Blitz drives up next to two pieces, kills him. Then he gets out the car and shoots him again. I don't know why he got out the car. And then it's like the police pulls up and Bliss, all right, the police pull up, Bliss, Bliss gets in a shootout with him. He goes for two. He literally takes his precious fucking time walking around to the driver's side. And in this bill, in this cabinet, he took his walk around to the driver's side. Two more cops pulled up and Bliss ended up getting killed. He gets a C plus plus because I don't know why he got out the car or why he was walking like he was invisible. So they come out the apartment like she didn't know what would happen. She didn't go back and stab biting her lip back to the mansion. He buying jewelry. He just making everything super hot. Two cops died off a of tip beans gave them. They have to take him down now. 20k for a necklace? No, I'm just saying he got much money he's spending. Cause he ain't got no job and neither does his girlfriend. Beans say Bliss not a problem because he got him handling two piece right now. Blue say I see him and I see him with two piece. B Bean say I set all that up. Two birds one stone. Blue say you gotta let me know what's up because he had me in the dark. Bean called Blitz a rat. I don't I don't I don't think I'm not I don't think that Blitz was a rat. I think that Blitz was a dude that came along to a situation and he said, Fuck it, I want to I want to I want I don't want to make my own plate. I I, I want to eat, but I don't even want to make my own plate. I'm, I want to just take your plate. But at the same time, Beans was walking around taking everybody else's plate. So, whatever. Blue said he got a little bread spit and laid his trash on the table. 
Let it settle in the rain, cause ten, and be like, I got five. Touch it outside the pool. Cool meeting in the pool has gotten bigger. He said he's taking over cities, but in the beginning he was saying the city was his. He said it's still a lot of hard work to be done in the street. Deep speak. I will tell you how it went, but I'm not, because I didn't even know who half the people at the table were. So he ate peanuts. He ate peanut, blue, and white do rag a ring to show he trusted them with his life. Then he tell the other seven that they four cards in the ring. And I don't know why that felt like a fish. Uh of uh, fish. Anyway, they say A B M for life. Dean's paid for strippers to be at his house. He spends too much money and doing too much. Like he didn't just make it hot. Put someone else in the crew in the, in the meeting with his crew. Voice over Dean saying he about to get rid of the old heads. He said they too sad in their ways. Too much partying and drinking his females. Sounds like him and his friends. He says his cat's grimy and thirsty. And when they start, and when they say, and when they say, get down, lay down, you get down, lay down, for real, A and B, when you lay down, you stay down. How he know what they doing right now? They think they can't be touched. They don't have a clue what's going going to happen, about to happen. They start hitting the whole old head delivery guy when they were picking up the money from the spot, a rap song, thought they were sneaking past me. The guys collecting the money were not paying attention to their surroundings at all. From almost a time. <laughs> the amount of times they pulled their gun out before they get near the person, they're going to shoot. So Damon calls me. <coughs> so Bean calls Damon. How he get Damon number? Yes, I'm okay. So being so being's not thinking. Okay, being said we gotta talk and we can work something out because your guy's dropping fast. Gotta remind being he got love that he can play. They can they they can play with too. They say I don't even know you. You don't even exist for beef, and all you do is making yourself hot. It's not affecting him because he got cake, and if he wanted him to be touched, he would been touched. He said I'm laughing at you, and we know. We take me a laughter. Damon say, well, we're going to call him boss. That's what I call him. Boss say, do what you got to do because if it's going to happen, it's going to happen. Bean don't know how to answer that. And boss hung up. Saying, how he get my number anyway? That makes sense. He be, since he been murdering Damon guys, someone took a phone and looked the number up. Bean says, Bean called Caesar and said, we got to talk business. Caesar asked how Bean, asked how Bean, how does he know she won't set him up? She set up bliss. Beans go off saying, if I wanted to set you up, why would I call? I could just have someone want to come through and take care of that ass and rock you. Beans asked if he, if Mandy got a call. If she, if if I'm Caesar, I'm going to go in the top and switch him. If I'm Caesar. See, she's a smart because she tell his girlfriend, go take a break so he can talk to Beans. She just say what you want, and then say, I figured we can work something out because there's a lot of money to be made. She just feels scary, and if police come and knock she's snitching. I'm calling it. She says, She's in the streets, are talking and saying, She about to roll with someone else. She just say she's small type and not moving no weight because he's just trying to eat like everyone else. She just say he would meet him, but he don't want to come up north because he don't feel safe that way. And then say, Where well, you want to meet me? She said, come to his shop, and then say, I'll be there in a minute. Is he outside the shop on the phone? Beep. Tell Caesar to relax. But Caesar, oh man. Bean tells Caesar to relax, and Caesar's sweating because she's so scared. Caesar tells Bean some weapons, and Bean hangs up on him. Later that big day, Beans doesn't come by himself. She just says, I'm keeping it real with you, man. Boss had asked him to join him first, and she just said she would get back with him. She just says he's just trying to look out for himself because he's a man, and he don't want to be talking like he's a boy, which Beans is doing right now. 
Dean said, Caesar, you can still work this. You can still work this. What he really said was, if you be on my side, I'll kill you. My bad, get down and lay down. Dean said, I got to think this over. And she said, hold on, Dean. I want a tight operation, and I don't need y'all heat. She said, no disrespect, but I need a little more time to weigh my options. Dean started curs- cursing, saying he not waiting while he make up his mind. I would say no. I'm done. Dean said, you think I'm going to let you sit around and try to play me? She was like, I'm not trying to play you. She just need a little more time to do the math. Dean said, F the math and pull out his gun. Because, you know, she didn't give this away. She tells she's you to go on, go on and get down and lay down. She's like, calm down. And why you aiming the gun at me? She's like, I don't have a weapon. And Dean's like, F you and shot him one time. She's on the floor bleeding and they start, and they still talking. Dean wanna go to speak. Tell she to think about it on his way to hell. And he wanna answer when he get there and shoot him three more times. Beans run to the car and get in and they leave. The police show up and guess what? She's just still alive. Beans going to jail because she's a snitcher. Boss gets seen with two naked chicks. An uh, extra girl walks, I mean, an extra guy walks in and Boss like, I'm naked here. You could have not. The chicks are making out with each other again. The extra guy says she's still alive and he going to testify. He going to, and he going to uh, testify against Beans to put him away forever, Boss. Boss say that would be a win-win. Then Boss say Beans was talking too much stuff and the chicks was watching. Beans, Boss was not even looking at the chicks making out next to him. Boss is good for how how did, how how you did after the event. Catch up party. Beans, BM, and her friends are out at the club. Who babysitting their daughter? Okay. So I don't even got to answer that because come to find out, um, Beans is at the home with the daughter. Boss is having to be in the same club. Boss like, I can't believe you brought me to a club with no females and it's hot. They see jokes and then his guy points to the table with Ben's BM. Beans and her BM and her friends are. Boss say, I know Beans BM not out here like everything peaky. Boss buys her table a bottle. They look over to who it is. The friend wants to go thank him, but Beans BM is like, did you kill me? The friend says she's just going to thank him. So Ben's be keeping the BM in the dark. She don't even know her life in danger. The friend goes over and thanks the table. And Boss says, come sit next to me. Boss says, I sent the bottle to your friend. What's the matter? The friend says she got a man and, be, and he be tripping. She say his name begin, his name Beans. And if he come up here, up there, it's going to be trouble. If only you knew you were about to die. The guy started Start, the guy started to snitch, but boss caught them off and said, don't listen to them, they drunk. Friends say, what you know, what you know him or something? And then boss tried to hit on uh, BM, and the best friend was just not going, so she got up and left. Boss said, I met him, but I don't know him like that. He said, if he coming to the club, club, and she said, I don't know, but he might. Boss get rude at the end and smacks on the bottom as she's leaving. Beans being like, did he grab your booty? Oh, yeah. And the friend, like, he must be drunk and someone needs to be his behind. Beans BM say she grabbed Beans wasn't there. Friend, like, he came to know your man, but he was so disrespectful. Instead of leaving or calling her man to lay, let him know his option in the same club or to go on dancing. One of these young ladies about to die before the night over with. Cut to boss from Jay-Z. I swear to God, I love all the parts of Jay-Z. Because Jay-Z is like, yeah. Yep, man. And it's like, are you really listening to me? Jay-Z says, what you do when boss calls her a suck a bitch? And Jay-Z is like, no, no. You gonna kidnap her? And uh, boss is like, yeah, yeah. I'm a, I'm a kidnapper. I, that's what I said. That's that's what I said I was gonna do. And that's not what he says, not that. I'm gonna do that and get outside. The girl in the club, one gets in her car. Well, one walks walks down the street. It's just it's just a BM and a friend. Neither a friend and being BM walking together. They walk and talk. Friends say she's still upset about boss making her behind. They're not paying attention to their surroundings and the jack man is sticking up on them. They waited till they got in the car to kidnap them. She 
He hit Fred in the face. He punched him in the face. Boss say he got a he gonna call Bean. Boss say wake up, I got some grub. Bean say who was this? Boss say you was talking all that stuff, thinking nothing gonna happen to you. You gotta pay the price. Bean say what you talking about? So Boss say if you want to steal BM, you know what to do. And Bean say you a dead man. Boss tells Bean he want fifty k since he was talking big stuff and. Be- Bean starts to talk stuff but takes a fall from his ear and starts breathing. Bean humble himself and say he got it. Boss said if I get my money, you get your girl. But if not, she gonna come back pregnant because she cute and he like and he likes her feet. Bean say, would you get this money you gonna need to bury your mother? Boss says, so so you. So you think I'm serious? She kissed Bean's DM on the cheek and tells an extra to kill her friend. Also, Bean's when he talks, when he stops talking stuff, and he still pays the ransom. So think about it. They left. They left her at another location. She tried to tell Bean to kill her friend in front of her. They took her clothes and left her underwear. She traumatized. He picked her up and take her home. She just told every told everything he knows. He didn't want life in prison. Ben get a call and tell his BM he'll be right back. He said you're not going nowhere. He said don't start that and he said he said he'd be right back. She said no you're not and he go off on her. But she scared that he's not coming back because he forgets she was off her friend the other day. Ben say what is it? What is it? That friend situation? She said I know you're going to handle it, but I want my daughter to have a dad. She said. It's time for him to be out the game, and all he say is, I told you I was going to handle it. I told you I'm going to take care of it. And it's like, that's not what she wants to do, but okay. He still leave her all alone. They have a meeting. Damon tell the crew that Caesar ain't dead, and this is, this is over. Well, it's over. White do they say they gotta, they just got to lay low. So, so, so they're smoking a the blunt and putting it out. More females dancing, naked. They had the bar and Tina said, this is not a good look. Beans look like he want to fight a kill. They show Beans with the mean while flashing back to the things he loves. Boss walks in the bar where Beans is at. Beans starts shooting at Boss. Neither have no arms. Nobody got shot. Nobody died. Boss telling Jay-Z how Beans shot at him. Boss complaining to Jay-Z like, it's okay. Jay-Z like, he shot at you? He done said that about three times. Jay-Z said, you got to probably handle that. Wow, this is funny what's needed. A police raid and arrest and arrest begin. Beans get up whole shooting. He did. They raided Beans house. Caesar going to testify against Beans. Shoot out in public, bodies everywhere, and they gonna make an drop on him. Beans like I got a daughter to take care of and Caesar can't testify. They tell Beans to cut a deal. Beans tells them to offer Caesar five thousand to say Beans wasn't involved. The lawyer says it's worth a try. And Bean said, I'll try to do it. White do rag and blue didn't go to jail because they were smart. White do rag and blue go, go into the courtroom and get in the shootout with the police and kill Caesar. The police kill White do rag after he shoots police officers. Um, blue take out two before he being killed. Jay Z hired a female to kill Bean. She did a GTA and came from the judge chamber and killed Bean. Then she put the gun in a suitcase and she left. We went we ended with a voiceover so we know Bean's not really dead. She just went to jail twice. That's it. The disrespect that popped off in this video towards females was just mind blowing. Um, but I really don't even know what you what you need to drop it down in the comments. If you want me to watch something, drop it down in the comments. If you want me to react to some movie, TV show, guys, girl from art, drop it down in the comments and I will try my best to get it done. Well, we're going to be on YouTube because that's our life now, YouTube.
until I get my phone back and I can go live me again. And then I might forget about you two people once I get my life my live life together. I'm okay. I'm still be posting videos to you guys. You wanna see my